Hey everyone, it's Miss Newman and I have a read aloud for the month of March for the IB attribute of communicator. And uh, for this book, I'd like you to think about whether you communicate in exclamation marks, in question marks, or in periods. Are you a statement maker, a questioner, or do you exclaim? Or maybe you do all three. Okay, so while you're listening to this book, I'd like you to think about which one you are. Exclamation mark by Amy Krause Rosenthal. He stood out from the very beginning. He stood out here. He stood out there. It seemed like the only time he didn't stand out was when he was asleep. He tried everything to be more like them. But he just wasn't like everyone else, period. He was confused, flummoxed, and deflated. He even thought about running away. Then one day, hello, who are you? What grade are you in? What's your favorite color? Do you like frogs? What's your favorite ice cream? When's your birthday? Know any good jokes? Do you want to race to the corner? Is there an echo in here? Is there an echo in here? What's your favorite movie? Do you know who makes gravity? Why do you look so surprised? Am I boring you? Do you think a snail could go around the world? So what do you want to do? Who's taller, you or me? What do you want to be when you grow up? Stop! He didn't know he had it in him. How'd you do that? Can you do it again? He wasn't sure. So he started small. Hi. That felt right. So he tried something bigger. Howdy. As he pushed himself a bit more, wow, he discovered a world of endless possibilities. Yippee, this is fun, way to go, bravo. It was like he broke free from a life sentence. Yes, you're it, cool, yum, that's great, thanks, wake up, go, boo. Home run, congratulations, happy birthday, encore, look out. He couldn't wait to show everyone. Hey guys, it's me, look what I can do. Of course, there was much exclaiming. Isn't he something? There was never any question in our minds. So with his head held high, he went off to make his mark. The end. <laughs>